No. All right, can you we start this think? podcast oh. now? Oh. Why do you have your laptop in front of you? <clears throat> He's mixing, brother. Notes. You got notes? He's mixing, brother. Look at him always, getting uh, getting older. Like, boy, wow. I've been had notes for this podcast for years. Like, no, you didn't. Go back to our first episode. You didn't. All have my notes. one gotta goes will been, always be in my notes. That's why I always have my phones. The one gotta goes, and I understand the one gotta goes. But I thought you had like genuine notes, like for the podcast. Yeah, because we we spend years away from each other, and then when we finally come back, it's like, damn, I wanted to talk about this one thing from months ago. Yeah, but I like that we take time away from each other because I have mad stuff. Like, I've been doing, see, for like this, like, I have mad new stuff, new plugins, all kinds of stuff that I've been experimenting with and trying that I just wanted to bring up, and like the same vice versa for you. So I, like, I guarantee that. No, that's never been a problem. I'm, I'm, I'm not complaining about that. I'm just saying sometimes I forget things because we all go through life, and then I go to the notes, and it'll be like, yo, yeah, we did want to talk about that. Do you have a one gotta go for us? Well, you didn't even introduce. I got bars in here too. I ain't gonna lie. I wrote Yo, we gotta do that. Yo, if y'all want that rap battle, audio rap battle, please let us know in the comments because I'm ready. I've been thinking about mad stuff, bro. Like, I've been thinking about mad stuff. But you want me to introduce the podcast? That's yeah. unlike you. Usually you have some stupid take you have at the very beginning. I mean, I do got a stupid take. Give me the stupid take first. I feel like. Nah, that's the one we're gonna get canceled for. That's it. We're we gonna get canceled for it? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Let me hear it. Now, nah, save it for behind the paywall, actually. <laughs> uh, shout out to everybody that actually is a uh, one of our paid subscribers and stuff like that. This is the My Audio Nerds podcast, the podcast for audio nerds like yourself. Please make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. Also, make sure that you comment right here in these comments mm-hmm. so that you could be one of the people that win the HMD Rosetta uh, Gold Edition EQ. Yes, the right. best comment in the comment wins. Also, shout out to our paid members. Um, uh, that are getting all that exclusive yes, content, or um, exclusive episodes, early access, mm-hmm. money. Uh, all of my yellow, you. all of my yellow discs. Congrats to all you. the yellow disc people. Facts, because I seen that some people have made two months like now, oh, so yeah, they have converted, and I see they got the yellow record next mm-hmm. to their thing. So mm-hmm. shout out to the people that have rejoined. Shout out to oh, yeah, we got some crazy special stuff Boy, coming. We got you. me and Devon talked on this couch about some funny shit the other day, man. What? I don't want to talk. It's behind a paywall, but we. What do you mean? It's come them, on. We gave them some good like. We yeah we had a great conversation. What you mean behind the paywall last week? Remember? What oh we yeah, did? yeah yeah, but they gotta yeah. you gotta go behind the paywall yeah, to see it. I'm not we not. Yo, you trying to leak all the information? Yo, what's going on? Um, his name is Devon Terrell. What what do you use? My name is Devon Terrell. I use uh Pro Tools. It's the game Pro Tools Sketch on the way. I, I don't out. know if y'all seen that. It's out already. Yeah, you you think you think you and your I um, thought it was already out. No no no, it's not out yet. But I oh seen, that was a teaser. But I seen you and your cohorts been taking the, these past two weeks by storm to like advertise your little cutesy little app. Yeah, yeah, we, we're a part of the culture. We're, we're we're trying to create Pro Tools culture. I feel like <laughs> yeah, I have no culture, but I also feel like <laughs> I'm I'm seeing that there's not a lot of loyalty in the audio community, man. What you mean? Because I'm general. seeing a bunch of other people from other doors use this Pro Tools sketch. Like, y'all don't have to go home. Yo, y'all don't have to go home. Is tears. Why can't Ooh, people? Can why can't people in I other doors use Pro Tools sketch though? Why can't married people go sleep with other women? That's not the same. It is. That is so far from the what you're what we're talking I mean, about. I mean, to, I mean to be fair, you I did, like you did say you be you did say you be cheating on plugins sometimes. I do so be cheating on plugins. I've been be, cheating a lot. Shout out my classic. Like he, huh? might going, <laughs> he might be going. He might be going. So he might be. <laughs> that was a crazy book. That no, you was know, crazy straight. My I ain't had song, to cheat in weeks. I ain't had to cheat in weeks. No, I've been cheating all for the past three months. I've been yo. What I mean, I've been swapping plugins out. Like yo, you actually suck. Like you're bad. You yeah. And I've been going back to plugins it's, that are basic. That I'm like, yo, this is still really good. Remember Max Bass from Waves? Yeah. I've been going back to Max Bass and Vitamin mm. lately. All right. Mm. So is that, that's just breaking up. That's not cheating. No, I'm cheating because you deep, go back to them? Because deep down, I'm like, mm, like I'm, I'm not going to lie. All right. I got a little hot take. I'm mm. not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. Mastering wise, the limiter. That is whooping some ass. I'm sorry Tell to curse. Him. God Tell particle him. limiter. Tell them what it is. It's that I'm sorry. That master plan limiter is really kicking some. It's some, that yes, master plan. It's really like we no. This. We ain't being paid. No, we ain't is, being this, paid. At this point, it's the decap payroll. They they found out the price. Yeah, decap said, is paying they... us a seven thousand a month. <laughs> you know he's not. But to be honest with you, and, and I want a lot of people to know. We didn't get paid a dime for that master plan. Mm-hmm. Um, everything in that master plan. We yeah. did not get paid a dime. If we did, I'd let you know. If we do, I hope, right? Uh, I will let you know. I ain't gonna lie, yo, Sam. You can't hit me. Like, I will sell you the rights to my <laughs> No, I'll sell you the rights to my preset. And you will never have to give me residuals on it. That Hard. FX preset, they added the FX. No, they didn't add it, but I saw an FX section in, in the where? presets in the master plan. So I'm like, yo, I think the L Gene presets on the way. Sam Fishman hit me up, man. I go by the name of L Gene. 
I'm an FL studio user. Right. Um, and I'm a YouTuber. Congratulations and, too, by the way, by yes YouTube sir. and stuff like that. And shout out to the kid. I want to shout him out no, so bad. After we're gonna talk about him later. Okay, okay, later. Okay. okay, okay. But to the left of me, what's going on with you, my friend? You don't know, bro. It's it's the Ableton astronaut. I said it before, but you know, kind of taking a chill back week today. Why are you taking a chill back week? I don't know, man. Just feeling like. He hasn't drank yet. That's you, what you, feel, you feel? Wow. That is funny and wrong. <laughs> you, you, that's funny and wrong. What, 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 what's, what's, funny. what's up with you? What do you mean show back like as far as making music and stuff like that? I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, you know, I'm just, I'm just chilling. I seen, I seen on our content, like for the past, uh, our clips for the past two weeks, I was like, wow, this is a different side of this young light skin man. And I don't Who, know if you? the world's ready for that. Yeah. No, no, no. You got to bring that energy. I really tried to, I really tried to like, I really, <sighs> we're going to talk about it after. But, you yeah. are great. I'm not going to lie. You was, oh, because you, oh, I think you hit me, yo, Courtney hit me the other day and apologized he watched a clip that he was talking to me and he was yeah. like yo bro i've been really like like shooting at shooting you, at you i was like oh, i was od and i was really OD'ing. you was com- yo i ain't gonna lie that one episode where you was like i don't get disappointed i was like yo. that was it that was it oh yo i'm not yeah. gonna lie i was ready that was tiz i ain't gonna lie ready. but okay but, been on one. can i tell you why i love this platform wow. why i love this platform and this podcast because so many people pay attention to us oh, and sure. watch this thing yeah that have no that we just are not aware of and I don't think we even realize like how many people watch this podcast man. and we're very appreciative to you if you want to become be a paid OG, member man. join OG. the link in the description I have something that I would like to surprise you guys with from a company that watches us and shout you out already to this, sent me master plan yes I, I I know but shout out to this company mm-hmm. because I think that this company sees the value in us yeah and they decided to invest in us and they decided to just kind of look out for us and just yeah. they take us seriously and I, I respect any platform audio platform that does that mm-hmm. so you ready for the surprise well so i'm scared all right drum roll please no drum roll no drum roll you get a car courtney apogee duet <laughs> was so gracious to send me over the apogee duet 3 yeah just for you Ain't that crazy? They sent over the Apogee Duet 3 just for my son, Courtney. Clap it up for Apogee one time, son. No cap. And Apogee has shown us... Show his face. Apogee, (laughs) Apogee, if you guys do not know, Apogee was the first company to ever show us... I'm not going to say to ever show us love, but... When we went to NAMM for our first year, the first building we went to was Apogee's building. That's a fact. And we, the first person we met from Apogee was her, the owner. Was the owner. Was the owner. Uh, uh, be, uh, I think it's thinking his Betty. I'm so sorry. I know her, her husband's and Bob. Um, but this is for you. And they asked us for a few things. And I'm going to tell you what they you know, got us doing and stuff like that. Yes. But first, they did want to sponsor the episode. And, and they got you that, bro. And they, they said the only thing you have to do to pay them back is to stop using Ableton. <laughs> <laughs> That's not true. But I'm going to say, is that really true? But I do want to mention something um, that they did send over, and they were basically they're doing a promotion. Mm-hmm. They watched the podcast, and they were like, "Yo, we lo- really love to get Courtney and Apogee do yep. at three. And they happened to be doing like an exclusive thing with um, Guitar Center on September twenty sixth. So they're using you mm-hmm. and using the platform just to kind of like showcase that. But they also want to give you that because you've been such a fan for it and talking mm-hmm. about it. So shout out to Apogee for that, dog. Shout out to Apogee. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, man. Congratulations, like, my like brother. Y'all. Uh... I actually might get some um some royalties <laughs> with whatever comes out of this. I'm not gonna lie. Not for real. Want to give somebody a percentage? Right? I do. Like this is like, bro. What I do? What I, I just asked a question. I just I just I was just joking, and they just really did this. Yeah, nah, bro. Y'all really. That's dope. Man. This this is my Man. favorite. This is probably one of my most famous favorite favorite moments on the podcast. Wow. Wow. This is insane. Bro. Just because it, I just I think it. I think it's also a good moment to realize like the impact of what we're doing and just yeah. like the influence you have and like yeah. people pay attention Ooh. and people res- like have respect for. It. So I do want to I do want to pay the bills one time since Ooh. they did this. Okay. I want to yeah, pay yeah, the bills yeah. one time. So long story short, uh, Apogee is doing a duet limited edition set in in September 26. I'll say that again. Apogee is doing a duet limited edition set. It comes out September 26th it's exclusively with Guitar Center. It also includes their Apogee Pultec EQP1A, their MEQ5 native plugins. Includes Clear Mountain Spaces native plugin, which I have to start trying because I've heard amazing yeah. things about it. Mm-hmm. And then includes the Duet Dock, Ableton Live Lite, and Melodyne 5 Essentials, which is at 1400 retail, but it's going to be 699 at Guitar Center. That's gonna that be is an insane 26. deal. Y'all yeah, better we'll go that. scoop that up. Yeah, it was really dope. Mm-hmm. But um, yeah, shout out yeah. to them, man. And just I'm just I'm again, so yeah, grateful you're, for you're, it. You're 100 right about like 
goodness, finding out who listens is scary. It's making me shut up. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I found out one of my one of my um, idols kind of tapped in a little bit, right? Okay. So today I was on live with my boy Swag. Shout out Swag. We got to get you back on the couch. That's a fact. Shout out Swag. And um, you know I talk about him all the time. My boy Dima, he came he came through. Ooh, right. He was on the live. He was chatting with us, right? And I found out something today that made me. You see, I rubbed the hell out of my eye because yeah. I'm, I'm about to cry. Um, the single tear. So D Mao did uh, production for Lucky Day, Victoria Lucky Day. Monet, Silk Sonic, that, that just last like y'all know. Victoria Monet album. Swag, her, her yeah. uh, Snow Allegra, Mad People. Mad just have to, sorry, have to do that. Mary J, yeah. Rihanna, yeah. It hurt. So today I found out that he, four years ago, switched from Logic, which I thought he was still using. To Ableton. Oh, oh so D Ma uses Ableton yeah. now? Yeah. Wow. And I, go, I found that out this morning. And if you saw my face on that live, it was like you can see me start to hurt a little bit. Shout but, out to Fabio. Cause Fabio said it the other week, and everybody like everybody was like, there's mad people that was like, we don't do that. Like he was saying logic users secretly use Ableton. Or but logic that's a users wild. secretly cheat. So let me ask you this. Mm -hmm. Do you think Okay, let's think. Let's do it like this. What DAW is most likely to use what DAW? So, like Logic users, it seemed like most Logic users would jump ship for Ableton. That's what I'm I'm okay. noticing. First of all, let me comment on DMO using it. I I think you're, you're still my favorite producer, right? I think <laughs> you using Ableton makes you greater than I thought you were, because for you to endure all of that pain. Hmm. All of that stress, mm. all of that CPU latency, mm. all of that lack of thump. You're talking about mm. latency and you use FL Studio? Absolutely. Did you hear your Oppenheimer fucking nuclear bomb last, the I other week? peak sound design. Yeah? Okay. 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 Um, so for you to do, to have to go through all of that and still create beautiful music as you do, man. <sighs> If if leave the door open was done in, in Ableton, I have some serious reconsidering to do. I'm like, yo, lie. I'll be honest with you. I mean, After Hours, an entire album. Oh, that was a uh, Elangelo. Elangelo. After Hours wasn't. Yo, entire... Elangelo. Mixed That's not it true though. In Ableton too. Yo, why are people lying? We I watched the mix with the what, master. But, we all but, did. Oh, no, but After Hours wasn't entirely produced. Like there was so many different producers on After Hours. Metro Boomin uses a kind now. He did three songs on. He's not. Wait, wait, wait. He's not using FL at nah, all. He, he switched to Akai. He he uses the all in one. Wait 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 wait. So uh, you're saying that Akai has like a standalone yeah. style yeah. with their with their oh, MPC. It's like using an MPC. And he switched over completely. Yeah. He, a lot of people well. like mm -hmm. the all in one, not having to use a laptop setup. Yeah. It's really clean, actually. I'm interested in and why machine. I ain't gonna lie, if machine created like how to push you don't need your computer to use uh the push. The push is a kind of a computer itself right if machine did that too i'm sure a lot of people would stop using the machine on the laptop i'm yeah. not gonna lie to you if i experiment with pro Tools sketch which i'm experimenting with uh experiment with right now and i'm able to hook that launch pad up to that um to pro Tools sketch in some way which i know eventually i'll be able to because i'm really really pushing shout out to my guy garav i've been pushing with him um to really be like yo bro go all in like i'm telling y'all because the fact that i can use sketch in my doll it just gives me so much more and i'm just like yo like start to just just let's fix the piano roll like it's just the simple things that i need because y'all been wilding i'm talking about fl that new piano roll y'all got another update and i was like what the fuck y'all got another got, update that's we OB. got we got snap to key that's hard what does that yeah. mean basically snap to the key so they if can you hit any see, note C and it just snaps. If you're on a C major scale, so snap to scale. If you're on a C major scale, then you can't hit a note. If you set it to snap to C major, you can't hit a note outside no of the No black scale. keys will even get hit. I mean, okay. No, it's auto tuned for. Yeah, <laughs> we've, just hate. We've, we've Can had I tell that. you something? We've Can had I tell you that. something? That's you know, just, you know I, what you it's guys cool have catching up. It's, it's, good to, it's cool to see y'all catching yeah, up. Yeah, Ben had that? We have a, we have a we've MIDI had device scale. called Scale. Yeah, a MIDI device. Yo, can I tell you something real quick? <laughs> Ooh. Everybody with the everybody with the exception of Ableton already had an app. You're not special. FL was first. Band Lab came through. My G. Logic came out this year. My G. Like I get it. It's personal. I, well, we do have app. Yeah. Yo, I want to let everyone know. I know we we're not special. I'm saying, oh my gosh, yeah, we're be... finally we finally have a foot in the race. That's all I'm I'm saying. Because yeah. we just never had a foot in the race with. Toe. Any Would of you that. rather be toe? toe. 
It's like a, would like you, a big toe. Yeah, a little toe. A big toe. Yeah, no, yo, but, bro, I am I agree. Would you rather would, but would you rather <laughs> would you rather make the playoffs and lose or not make the playoffs and get a first pick? Ooh, that's a good question. Hmm. I'd rather make the playoffs and lose. I'd rather not make the playoffs and get a a, a top three pick. I'd rather get the. I'd rather get my entire team to have the experience of yeah. get, getting in the playoffs. I think I'm going to. We game. will t- a year from now when our top three pick is going crazy. Yeah, but let me ask you this. Let Why me, would let, you let rather? Me, let me say this. Everybody, just because you have a huge um, first round pick doesn't mean you're going to the championship. I never mm-hmm. said championship. It may take you six more if years. Our team is capable of making it to the playoffs barely. Without you an didn't amazing say that. addition, you didn't say that. You, I said, would you rather make the playoffs or not make the playoffs and get a great pick? If I make the playoffs, right, mm-hmm. that tells me that I am at least building a team that is capable. So I would rather keep building upon what that we have. Team. Like but, I, I'm not gonna just be like, yo, screw it and bomb. I hate that idea when it comes to that type of shit. It's like, screw it, let me just bomb right. and call it a day. Let me flip it like this, right? Mm-hmm. Let me flip it in Spanish. I knew you was going to do that. <laughs> Shout out Wyclef. <laughs> Shout out Wyclef. I want Wyclef on this couch too. That would be um, amazing. Because I want to know what DAW he uses. Facts. Oh. What do I, what do all you think he uses? Logic. He looked like a, yeah. I, yeah, I feel I like he, he would he use, logic. use logic. Yeah, if yeah, we're yeah right. Man. Wyclef would use logic yeah. for sure. Flip it in French. Um, I forgot my whole point, but I will say, y'all want to be Apple so bad. Who? Pro Tools. Mm. That's not true. Yes, y'all do. That's not true. Because y'all are no, late, you're right. Y'all are late to everything, but y'all. Presented and marketed to us like it's different. Like the only thing y'all were ahead of was removing something. Removing something. Y'all removed the perpetual license in favor oh of, spir- of subscription. That was a the same way. Shot. The same way not, not iPhone removed the headphone jack Ooh. in favor of AirPods. Damn, that did push us to AirPods. That pushed the whole thing to AirPods. They announced at the same hour. <laughs> Who? Apple. They announced the headphones. The iPhone 7, they announced it, and then the next 30, 30 minutes later, they said, we also got these new Bluetooth headphones. Wow, that was kind of filthy. Can I ask you a question? Do you think Apple cares about Logic? I don't think it's a priority, but I think it's an amazing loss leader. I agree with you. Yeah. I feel like they're not investing a lot of, people, as much as they could into, we, we, and they're losing we've, market share to Ableton. We've spoken this theory prior. Like, It's an amazing loss leader. Things like that, and the final cut, it's like, you get enough people to love it and depend their careers on it, right. they will never leave Apple. That's true. So they will always buy a Mac. That's true. And if you already have a Mac, you might as well get an iPhone for the integration. That's true. And if you need a tablet, you're going to get an iPad. And while you're at it, I know Roku's are 40 bucks, but you can spend an extra 60 for the uh, Apple TV That's because true. now you can connect everything to it. And while you have the Apple TV, um, you might as well get the HomePod so you can get the stereo crib thing. And while you have the HomePod, you already use Siri for everything else. Like, you know what I mean? It's all an ecosystem. So and it's, it's eco- the, Right. It's it all based the on the ecosystem. best ecosystem. It is the best ecosystem. I'm not going to lie. And that's the only reason even for me, I switched over from Samsung year, like a couple years. Like I, my first iPhone was an iPhone 6. It's my first iPhone. Hmm. That was and that's late. Like that yeah. was mad late yeah. because I was so caught up in Galaxy and Samsung. Their watch, I liked it a lot more because literally even the watch, I had the ability to change my channel on my TV. Universal remote on the watch. I, I had a lie. camera on the watch. It just there was just so much. So when you say that, I think about the ecosystem that I'm in, right? Mm-hmm. As a Pro Tools user, and I say, okay, as a Pro Tools sister, what really is my ecosystem? There it, is no ecosystem. It's it, there really is. There's one ecosystem. Oh, it would have to be our plugins, there's, but but no, that's not an ecosystem. It, it, there's that's, one. Everyone's ecosystem is plugin based. No. No. So what is FL because Studios every, ecosystem? There's no. I don't think there's. There's only one DAW that has a a, a solid ecosystem. Luna. Every, no. Who? No. Luna has an ecosystem. No, because no. you don't. You you yes you have Luna, but you're not a dependent on Luna or UAD plugins to run Luna. Yes, you can. No, so you kind of are. No, you're not. Be, so, okay, so let me say this: the reason why I can't get Voice of God right now and UAD is because I need a UAD hardware or UAD satellite. Not I need anymore. a UAD. But piece. that's not. That has nothing to do with Luna. But I'm. But Luna's that's a eco- standalone. It's an ecosystem. It's an ecosystem. To an extent, but at the same time, with iPhone. Um, you you literally can't do certain things without like you're you. Let me put it like this. Mm-hmm. Forget everything I'm about to say. Okay. There's only one company, one DAW that yeah. has a ecosystem. fully functioning, great hardware software ecosystem that their people stick to. Who? Everybody else is BS. Native Instruments, 
machine has the mm. machine did uh the machine literally your machine hardware mm. works so seamlessly with the machine program mm. right your mas- uh your complete your plugins they're right there That's true. you cop it they work the best with machine okay yeah. um and the machine ex- the expansions for the machine plugins mm. like i have a bunch of native instruments expansions right. yeah. that give me an extra few sounds for Rome or mm, about to say, um, yep. a few sounds for no like whatever like and they're play series and all of that in, yeah. but you know what I don't get to indulge in what mm. and I know there's a way but I don't my, like mm. the machine upgrades and the extra loops and the extra samples that mm. work directly with your machine micro or the mm. machine MK3 that work with the machine they don't, I tried to use my micro with my FL Studio it's not it's, good it's close oh, it's, it's, it's not gonna work but it's so well versed in native instruments already have the plugins. Right. Now they have the effects with this damn monopoly that they yeah. put together. Yeah. Right. And they have the program that works really well. Right. And reputable people use the program. Uh-huh. Reputable people. So people will buy everything that it comes with. Gotcha. And they make it work so well. Mm-hmm. Every two years there's a new update. Like That is true. I it, agree with them. I, I nobody ahead. else has something that like a no other DAW. Right. No other program uh-huh. has something so universal where everything is covered, like a system iPhone, like that, like, yeah. like Mac OS, where you have the laptop, right. which is your machine, right? Right. Mac OS is your whatever, right? And then every add-on you get, or even better, I I can say the iPad because every add-on you get, you'll get the the keyboard for the iPad, right? Then you'll also get the AirPods for your headphones, right? And then you'll also get. Whatever, like the, the Apple your pencil, your Apple pencil, and your Apple pencil, your Apple TV. So, so here, okay, the Apple Watch. Like, so I will say, I'm not gonna lie to you. I, I'm not gonna fight you on that. I think you're absolutely right. I think Native Instruments may have the most underrated ecosystem ever. I think it's the only true ecosystem in. I think so too. Audio in our production. Audio, I think so. I because think he's, I'm not gonna lie. I kind, I'm kind of with it because I- my dog has hard has hardware. For sure. It has hardware. It has hardware. And my dog has software, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. But as far as... Nah, bro. Damn, bro. You, I ain't gonna lie. We There's got an no ecosystem system. too, bro. No, I don't think so. No, I think we. Not, I think we second to no, native... No, I'll, I'll give us second to you're native not. instruments. I can tell you why you're not. How? If anything, Luna is. No. Because it's the closest to it. You, my friend... No. We. You but, know how I could tell you Pro Tools doesn't have an ecosystem? How? Because none of y'all indulge in that ecosystem. I know everybody that I know uses machine has something native instruments. Okay. And, and that's awesome even if they don't use machine, we all use something native instruments. The same way mm-hmm. a lot of people like Windows, a mm-hmm. lot of people like um uh, a lot of people like Windows, a lot right. of people like Beats headphones or different headphones and right. but they still have an iPhone. iPhone. I think so you're right. So you're right. Pro Tools I, I could I think eight I would I'm going off a ledge, but I'm going to say it. 80% of people that use Pro Tools today, uh-huh. that pay monthly for Pro Tools, yeah. do not use it with the inbox. They're That's not, they're not sure. tapping in. They're for not sure. tapping in. So okay, like, let me just uh, help uh-huh. this point too. Uh-huh. I agree with him because definitely I think where you're looking at or what Levin is trying to say uh-huh. is the fact that standalone wise, yeah. like just if you go up to the regular, like the average Pro Tools user, yeah. they're not utilizing more the than just thing. Pro Tools. Y- you're right. And you Pro know? Tools That's doesn't true. offer anything outside of Pro Tools. If you want to say the inbox, which I'm not they saying. They do. The M- Okay. I'll tell let, you. Let, let, me, let me get it off. Go ahead. Pro Tools does not offer anything outside of Pro Tools okay. that is beneficial to anybody that doesn't use Pro Tools. That doesn't Tools. use Pro Tools. That's also very true, too. That's so, also very true, okay, too. Okay, so so there's truth. Hold on. There's truth to what you're saying. Okay, I want to be very clear because I don't want people to think like, oh, he's just... No, no, no. There's truth to what he's saying. What I will say is that I think that Pro Tools mm-hmm. just avid, I feel like, just needs to do a better job and ex- at exposing... What is actually in the ecosystem? For instance, we have something called, I think it's called Sonic Drop. I barely know what it's called. Okay. Where they are, they are constantly um, adding new loops, new sounds constantly to this ecosystem of being able to access like kits and things of that nature. And they're mm. really dope. There's a lot. Right. There's a lot of that. Just how Slate has, which you put me onto, Slate has their packs of mm. sound kits and stuff like that, like the Pasadena pack and stuff like that, which is OD. So Pro Tools has so much stuff in Avid Link, which I'm pretty sure a lot of people that even are watching this are like, are Pro Tools users heavy? Like, oh, I see that, but I don't know what it is. Bro, there's so many discounts. There's so many deals. There's so much stuff that's in Avid Link. But once again, even for me, I'll be honest with you. I don't know about it and I don't use it because I just don't know. I don't know what I do. It's See it like this. 
when I look at my DAW, right? And we're talking about ecosystems, right? Mm -hmm. I am not saying that, oh, it beats native. I'm not saying that. What I'm saying is, do we have an ecosystem? No. Yes, we do. We because have an ecosystem. What are you talking about? We have Sonic. hardware, we have software, we have plugins. We, what are you Can talking I tell about? You, a true ecosystem, just because you have everything, does it, look, listen to me. If you're not offering anything to anyone outside, I, I genuinely believe if you can't offer anything to anyone outside of your home. your main home, yeah. it can't be technically considered. Because so how can you Avid not use hardware? You, you can use hard. You can use listen other hardware. You listen can use to me. Avid hardware going, outside of Pro Tools. My brother, I'm not saying course. it's a good ecosystem. I'm not I'm saying, saying it's we, an ecosystem at all. I'm gonna go off your example. Sonic Drop, Sonic Boom, whatever it's called. Yes, you're gonna not only. Now oh, you're gonna say, "Oh, you can't use it." I'm no. I'm going off of your examples. Yes, and I'm telling you, yo, listen, listen, because you're not listening to me. You are correct. Oh my God, you're correct. Our ecosystem is not great. It's, it's not, not effective. Not listen, your ecosystem is our ecosystem is not great. It's mm -hmm. not effective. What I'm saying is, it is an ecosystem. It's not a great. You keep saying it's I don't not agree an ecosystem. That it's an ecosystem because y'all offer nothing but a program. We, I just. What about the heart? So you're just what well, we ignoring yeah, hardware. Yeah, I'm. T I've. I've been a avid person. On, bars. I've been an avid mm -hmm. person on this podcast for months mm -hmm. that have said the M box is not a Pro Tools product. So I'm not mm -hmm. giving you hardware. All right. See, and that's why I can't have the conversation. No. Because now we're looking. Because be now you're looking at avid. No, 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 no. Because no. you're separate. Because you're looking in Image Line, and then you're saying, yeah, but that's FL Studio no. thing, and that's a thing. Listen, like, but, I, but I could even. Look it's over our here. company. What do we do? Like, I what are we like talking about? That's bro, our company, bro. But to be fair, but to be fair, because I would I'm say, not. I would be humble enough to say the same thing about Ableton. Ableton doesn't have an ecosystem. Granted, we do have the push, and yeah. the push could be utilized other stuff, but it's not. I think that's more so a, like Levin said, it's an add-on, and it it does help. Who uh, the user of the DAW? Of the DAW. But I think what he was getting at with the machine point, yes. depending on how much users tap into that and yeah. feed into that, and how much they do it on a daily, how much it is a regular for yeah. the regular user of that DAW. Yeah, that's what makes it an ecosystem. And okay. I, I feel think... like everything that's not, I feel like there's a difference between having add-ons and having an ecosystem. I think yes. an ecosystem things have to be able to be used independently. I should be. Now I don't have to, I shouldn't have to be a Pro Tools user mm -hmm. to have not only be access to that Sonic Boom, mm -hmm. but Sonic Drop. To eat, I, right, Sonic I, drop. I hope we saying it right now. It's Sonic Drop. <laughs> I shouldn't I shouldn't have to be a an uh a Pro Tools user to mm -hmm. not only have access to so Sonic Drop, but have easy integration in a in a sense. Like mm. um native instruments. Their plugins aren't harder for me to use because I'm not a machine person. Mm. But they so are just add-ons. So that's you. So okay, like okay, okay, like okay. Apple. So AirPods can be used with an Android. Um, MacBooks. You don't need to have an iPhone to use a MacBook. So that's like your. That. So your rubric yes. is that it's easy to use whether or not mm -hmm. you are a part of the main have the main program or not. I think no. The ecosystem is. A main hub that offers many other individual things that, that can be independently, used independently. Yeah. That independently can be used outside independently. Of the main but when it but when drum. it comes back to the main, uh -huh. it is it also used easy, seamless, easy, not easy just to use. That, yes. that, yeah, it, not not just easy to use. But when it comes back to the main, it uh -huh. kind of makes the main doors like experience, experience yes. better. even better. Yes. Okay, in that in that scenario, I say to you, yo, once again. Our ecosystem as an avid Pro Tools user, it's, it's not, not great. You keep adding <laughs> it's look, not good. And I'm going to keep saying, I do not believe it's cap. Pro Tools <laughs> is an ecosystem. Just because you have a parent company doesn't make you an ecosystem. Because I'm not adding- <laughs> That makes I, no sense. No, that's, listen. That's, listen that's, a, that's, a, that's a no, contra, that's a, that's straight redundant. up. I get it. I, I, I don't- Listen. I'm I'm not at it. Get mad all you bro, want. I'm bro, wearing I'm a not. shirt that says Pro Audio Design. That's right? amazing. Pro Audio Design. Do you know what they? Do you, it, that, that's Look. all. You know what falls under them? Yeah, I Aus see. Burgers. It's on your shirt. It's on so your shirt. So are you saying that this is not an ecosystem? L you're switching the conversation. Can I because get my? Let me get that, my point. Let me get my point. You're saying that let me if get my there's point. an umbrella. No, no, no. Because no, no, no. I just want to make it clear. You're saying that if you have a parent company, that everything underneath it is not a part of an ecosystem. Listen, and I'm Serato like, that's not is now true. Serato is now under the same umbrella as Pioneer. Serato and Pioneer. Is not an ecosystem. Those are two. No, they're no. So I'm, we're not going to get. See, no. So do you think that? And, no. Okay, okay. So since that acquisition has just happened, yes. do you think that there's going to become a seamless integration Absolutely between no. the two? So you no. think there's going to be no going integration? To, I think a hundred percent. Why? Because that would be illegal. 
They cannot. They do already that. bought them though. No, they with the with the guidelines of there will not be any type of so, Serato and Pioneer must still work separately. Mm. So no, I'm not expecting any of that from that. that Wait a minute. That is that's the term a, of their an, a extreme conflict of interest, agreement. and it is extremely fucked up. If Pioneer gets seamless or whatever special access to Serato, the industry standard, why is that fucked up? Because there are other competitors that do not have that same advantage, and it'll be extremely unfair to the playing group. That's very that's true. That's a monopoly. That's very true. But mm. has, has this been legally... Um, yes. This is legally being discussed? A corporation is a... No, no. Yes. I, no, I get yes. it, but I'm just saying, did that legally like yes. did they legally discuss that yes. and say that in the terms of the deal? Yes. That's not allowed. They're not they're, they're, they will continue, <laughs> they have vowed to continue to work as separate as yeah. independent yeah. pieces. Yeah. Yes. Because if they take separate the Serato secret, because they, that's they can take it and say, yo, that's it. No other DJ equipment well, can use. They will never do that because Serato would then fold. Of course. Like of course. no, but yeah, Whoa. no, I don't want to hear that. <laughs> Look, what I'm saying is Yeah, wrap it up. Fuck, you made me lose my damn train of thought. Let me My example for you. The reason, another reason why I think, yeah, no, a, avid. First of all, yeah, just because you're a parent company doesn't make you a a oh, what you call it a ecosystem. Ecosystem. I'm sorry. You I see, think that's I'm BS. Talking. I think that's 100. percent Avid does not offer. What does no. help me, Devon? Listen, Pro to, I, bro. We are talking about DAWs. Pro Tools. We're talking about parent companies. Pro, no, you made it bigger than Listen, DAW. It's bigger than DAW. Bro, no, you <laughs> made it bigger than DAW. Because you're talking about parent companies not having anything under the parent company is not an ecosystem. And Listen I'm like, yo, to me. what do you mean? Like the uh, until Pro Tools tells me the M box is a Pro Tools item, I'm not going to hear it. Arturia makes it clear, hey, even though our 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 keyboards are work with every plugin. It is prioritized in Arturia, mm. right? When you use V Collection, it'll work seamlessly. Same with Native Instruments. Even though I can use it with Citrus and I can use it with Serum, when I open up Noah's uh, Noah's Forties Keys, it, there's a different type of integration. When I open up um, Complete Control, there's a seam. That screen is going to show me every plugin that I have from them. Not gonna yeah. lie to you. Not gonna lie to you. Mbox is not special in Pro Tools. Not gonna lie to you. Real quick. Period. Real quick, real quick. I don't. I get it. I can't. Avid makes Mbox, but I, bro, if I plug in Mbox into Pro Tools, it does not give me anything special that it doesn't give me in FL Studio. That's not it true. It works the same. Set. There's literally a button on the Mbox that says Mbox Control. It literally is integrated. I can literally map the buttons on the Mbox Studio. I'm telling you, you, don't, you probably don't even realize like what that thing Listen. is. I can literally map the the buttons on that Mbox interface to pieces in Pro Tools. And I can't do that in FL. No. Are, no. you, are you sure? I'm, I'm 90 percent sure you cannot map your same things in your in your software. I'm not saying like the that. same things. Can I map anything? I think, so I can map things. See, like this. I can map things, and, and I, I I do stand corrected. Hold on, let me clear that up. I can map things on that inbox um control to the actual inbox app within the inbox app, as far as inbox control to the but inbox. inbox app. And that's then, a different app than Pro Tools. And then on top of that, I can also use programs that integrate with it. And then there's an inbox control button that I can press. Mm -hmm. Like, bro. Okay. All right. Okay. If okay. You okay. Can okay. tell me one thing. That okay. Mbox can do in Pro Tools okay. that I can't do in FL. And I I'll understand. Give you it. And I understand that. And mm -hmm. I understand that. As far as the mappable, I'm not gonna lie. That mappable shit, you can do that outside. It's it's it, it exists outside of Pro Tools. Like you got you got that. I'm not gonna lie to you. What I'm fucking saying is, and sorry, I'm sorry to curse <laughs> if you got kids right now. I'm sorry. What I'm saying, this is a great conversation. Yes. I just want to make this clear. It's a mm -hmm. great conversation. I'm here for conversation. That's it. Yes. But what I'm saying is this, mm -hmm. and we we can agree to disagree. Yeah. We can call it a day. Yeah. Comments. Y'all can go crazy. Kill me. Kill him. Whatever. What I'm saying is. When we're talking about ecosystems, we're rapping on this. Don't fucking no, say nothing. I have something. Let me finish. I have to shoot at you. Let me say this. Say it. When we're talking, no, we're done. You're fucking. No, I gotta get my closing argument too. You see how you're not you not? You did. You just no, got your. You just no. got your closing you argument. You want me to get my closing argument first? You did. No, 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 no. My closing argument is this. Now, I'm gonna tell you hurry this right up, now. Hurry up. Hurry up. I ain't my got closing, time for this. No, I'm putting this down. <laughs> my closing <laughs> argument is this. Sony. Okay. Does the Sony A7? Whatever, what is it called? A7S3 A7S or A7S A7 A7 Mark IV, right? Okay. Does it work in Acid Pro Special compared to a Nikon? It's the same shit. Doesn't matter. Wait, what? It's not special. I know what you're trying oh, to I say. See, I see what you mean. It's not like, oh, but here's what it does special. Yes. Yeah. Black Magic, for instance. Their camera, They does make it... the Atom. The Atom, it only works integrated-wise, specially, with Black Magic cameras. And that's the that's the machine. That's an ecosystem. No, that's the machine. But do you yeah. but is that the ecosystem? Yes. Okay. So yeah. uh, so now we finally found but Sony a standard. No, no, no. I'm agreeing with you. Yeah. Shut up. We finally found something we agree on. Okay, cool. That's right a standard. Going, if we're right. talking about that, you Pro got Tools it. Pro Tools is more like Sony. You got 
you got it. For sure. So if we talking about it in that regard, which I'm glad we, I'm like, yo, you on that, I agree with you. Then you're right. We don't really have a piece of hardware, software kind of integration that is like, whoa, this is specially for Pro Tools. So if we're basing the ecosystem on that, mm -hmm. we don't got one. I agree with you. Shut up. We're out of here. The C800 sounds better in Sony Acid Pro. I'm telling y'all. We this try is, this. Can I tell you something real quick? Go ahead, real Courtney. Quick. You know, you know, it's a you know it's a plugin ecosystem that you use. What? Uh, creative sa create sampler from Waves. I'm not gonna lie, I don't see no one that uses Create Sampler and don't use Cosmos. That's well, I mean, they're supposed to work. They they work together. Yeah, man. but but they do. But, but they're so but separately. The thing. They're so separately, and they work seamlessly together. You got it. I like that. If that's what it, if you that's you got to tell you. But can you gotta Cosmos tell your work to... without Create yes. Sampler? Yes, yes, it can. Okay. Yeah, for sure. I love it. That's an but, ecosystem and proves your point. Okay, cool. So you gotta advertise. Y'all gotta advertise. Garab, bro, what's going on? I think a partnership is more than an ecosystem, though. I'm, I'm kidding. A partnership kidding. is more than an ecosystem. You just shot Ooh. from half. I feel like I don't know That's what happened, yes, but I'm gonna run that back. I like that. Hey, this... FL Studio X Auto Tune is on the way. Listen, this has. <laughs> oh, I forgot oh, about that. Yeah, we gotta talk That's about that. Really happy. This has been the My Audio Nerds Podcast. A podcast for audio nerds like yourself. I really enjoyed this podcast. That was yes, a sir. real debate. Yes, I love this. Guess what? We about to go drink together. Uh, you're 20. Um, uh, uh, said please alcohol. make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. Also, please make sure you become, if you want, a paid member. I'll leave a link in the description below where you get exclusive access to uh, episodes, uh, mix and master videos, all kinds of crazy perks if you join. The link is in the description. Remember, one lucky person in the comments is going to get that HMD Gold Edition VIP Rosetta EQ. This has been My Audio Nerds Podcast. Wait, we out of here. I'm giving away a free month of membership to one of my subscribers. Show me love on my oh, own YouTube okay. channel. Show me some love. Subscribe to me. I'm going to pick okay. one of my subs uh, from a random video, and I'm going to give you a free month and our membership. So hit me, uh, subscribe, and this has been the Audio Nerds Podcast. Devon was wrong, and we're out. That's not... All right. See, I didn't like how you ended that. That was funny. But no, no, no. I want. I, I was going to let you get I thought you were going to make a, a very confusing-ass contest. Just no. I was like, make it simple. All right, we out of here. Now we're out of here. Bye. Yeah.